Hello. No, you start this one. Hi. So, we're in a car, as you can see. There's some countryside that we've seen before, and there's more countryside over there. And there's this guy. Hey. So, tell the good people where we're going. Manchester. Why? UK Nationals. Are we excited? Yeah, and I'm excited not to crash the car too. That's yeah. quite important. It's uh, You can't really see it on this, but it's absolutely lashing down rain outside. A lot of cars. Very miserable. So, yeah, we're on our way to the airport. That's where we're going. It is Friday the 23rd of May. Yeah, it is. I finished my finals yesterday. Yes, he did. <laughs> so, so I'm flying straight to nationals with very little prep. Little to no prep. It's okay, I'm prepped this time. I even know what deck I'm running. It's crazy. This time, last time we were doing these bits, I was like, I don't know, I could run any of three decks. Um, this time, I know what deck I'm running, but I was hoping to run a Charizard Rayquaza deck, but Which I actually works very cards, well. and they haven't arrived in time. You so know, they're gonna come like tomorrow morning. Oh, they'll they'll arrive tonight. First thing yeah. tomorrow. You're gonna get a message and it's gonna be like, hey, cards arrived for you, and you're gonna be like, ugh. Uh, well, it just means that I have to stick with Old Faithful. Yeah. Except with some serious modifications. Definitely serious mods, and it works. Uh, a dark deck with Blast Toy CX. Watch this space. You heard it here first. Unless you heard it somewhere else, in which case, no, you didn't. In case they stole it from me. Yeah. Just saying. Yeah. Should I tell them what I'm doing? Yeah, Brutal Bash. Yep, yeah. Brutal Bash. Zorak, Brutal Bash. Main hitter, Zorak. Surprise. Yeah, so I finally got all the cards I needed for a dark deck, and I was gonna go plasma, have everything in for spent a lot of money. To spent build. a lot of money to build. <laughs> a lot of money to build it. No, you you ordered a booster box and all the tins and boosters you needed, and then go. Actually, I'm gonna build this relatively cheap brutal bash deck. Yeah, some of the decks, some of the cards I was using in the other thing, I'm using as well. Yeah, so I'm good. But still, and I still have plasma at my disposal. So anyway, yeah, I was gonna run Plasma, and it works, it's a good deck. Played a few games with it, and it, it really goes like the Clappers. <laughs> clappers. Yeah, I get it. Um, so yeah, there was that, but I've decided to go with Brutal Bash, uh, with bangles and muscle bands and lasers and Burbanks. <laughs> and Tell them about your derp moment. Which one? The one you had earlier. Where I completely blew your mind. Oh yeah. I decided to pack in a silver mirror just in case I need it. But he was giving out about how like his deck just is not fully there against plasma, and he just needs one extra turn. With sometimes, yeah. And I was like, silver you know, mirror, silver mirror, and he was like, <gasps> mind blown. You could see everything going off in his head, like Boo! fireworks and pennies dropping everywhere. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all we've got to say between now and yeah, now in Manchester. Pretty much. So, brutal bash, FTW. Uh, hopefully it Watch, you'll see footage from later on tonight where he's going to be crying, going, I'm going out to the plasma, I love looking here. And that would probably be going, I want to run Blast Toys! <laughs> Why didn't I bring Blast Toys? I did bring Blast Toys. Ah, and there we go. So it could be okay. It's the Blast Toys I ran the last time, I don't really want to run that again. It's a good deck, it's a great deck, I love that deck, but it's just, you know, Change I want to try up. something different, yeah? Shake it up. So yeah, that's it from us. We're getting close enough to the airport, so we're gonna stop this part of the recording now and we'll be back in touch later on in the night with you guys. Cool whip. Bye! You don't have to do it at the end of every section. Oh, get, get him! Look at him flatten the ground! You flatten oh, that ground! you flatten that ground! You flatten that ground outside of the airport that you can't really see. But it's there, trust me. It's the airport. It's the airport. 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 And we're gonna go, Wee. That's oh. like. Airport, airport, airport. And stop. Airport. Uh, what's about? Well, it is... Late-ish. It's... 20 to 11. Yeah. We got here at... An hour ago. Order to 10. There, our flight was delayed due to bad weather. Then... We couldn't find our bus. And because we of... just missed it. And because of the delay, we had to wait an hour on the bus. So that was fun sitting in the station. And then we had an hour's bus ride. And we got outside the place, the 
where we were meant to get off the bus and then kind of got lost looking for this place then a happy accident we found it and then we were like oh we haven't eaten all day yeah so the, like the la last time we'd eaten was what 12 o'clock yeah. Uh, one o'clock. One o'clock, yeah, yeah, I think. Yeah. So then we found out food stopped serving at ten o'clock and we so checked in at up, quarter two. So it was literally up to the room. <coughs> and uh, yeah. Also, Kieran, give me that. <coughs> yeah. Now, Kieran is an absolute nightmare if we're calling dibs on stuff. Like if we're at a restaurant or hanging in a friend's house or whatever, he'll always call dibs on the best seat or. The, the best area. Anyway, so the moment I got in the room, even though I've paid, I called dibs on the bed. So I've got this bed, and Kieran's got this lovely little bed. Yeah, but all the people watching this want to snuggle on this bed. Nah, they got. The, I got. I got. I got the big one. So just let me. Uh, oh, 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 the room. Anyway, so the plan. For the night is Kieran. A uh, couple of games of cards. Recently, even cards into our tournament decks. Right, deck deck list. right out deck lists. Sleep up early, breakfast, get across, register, and then find snack foods to keep us going for the day. Because it's gonna be a long day. Tomorrow. It's gonna be a long, long day. Longest we've ever had. I think so. Is it nine rounds? Nine rounds is best of three. So a potential twenty-seven games tomorrow before. Yeah. A potential of a further fifteen on. Yeah. Oh. Well, it's a top 32 from what I've heard. So. Yeah. So. But there's talk of a top 64. That'd be nice. If we'd yes, have a, a good chance at that. So let's say you won it all in straight games. You need to win 18 and then t you need to win 28 straight games over two days to win it outright. Well, 20, 28 games total. Yeah, but if you won 28 straight, you'd do it over. Yeah, but. Yeah. The, the chances of that happening? Well, I'm confident. I impossible. <laughs> yeah. You're, you're, gonna you're always going to have a couple of bum games. Yeah. yeah. So that's pretty much it. Um, if there's anything going on later in the night, probably not like the last time we're completely settled on our decks. And um, remember earlier I was telling you about that, the cards I'd ordered and uh, they hadn't come on time? They arrived today. Just as you were about to get I, on the plane. I got the text message the moment I sat in the plane to say that they'd arrived. So, too little, too late. I don't get to run Charizard. Oh. Um, it was a Charizard Rayquaza Embor uh, Pyroar deck. Could have been fun, but sure. There's always worlds if we somehow make top four yeah, at this. We make top four at this. Somehow. Anyway, uh, talk to you in a while. Later. Bye. Morning, guys. It is five past eight in the morning. Uh, we only played like three, four games. We were absolutely exhausted last night and just went straight to bed. So there wasn't really a whole lot. Kieran got had his usual little hissy fit because his deck wasn't working, and then it started working once he took a break. Um, so that calmed him down. He's still going with Brutal Bash. I'm going with uh, Garbo Toxin Darkrai. He felt all. I was going to throw in a Blastoise EX instead of a Bufalant, but I don't know. I think I'm going to leave it and just stick with a Bufalant. Um, not a whole lot going on. We woke up at about half six this morning. Uh, we're, we've gotten breakfast. There's a lot of players knocking about. Uh, a lot of people wearing world stuff from last year, which is sort of worrying, but I think they're all VGC players, I want to say. I'm not fully sure. Um, we actually are a lot closer to the event than we thought, which is pretty cool. Check out my cool t-shirt. See if you get it. See, it's Squirtles, but they should be Turtles. I don't think you get it, but yeah, that's, that's my t-shirt for today. Um, it's going to be fun. Hey, Carol, say hello. Hi. You all set? Yeah. No, you're not. Well, just in the back of my bag and then one. You set? Absolutely. I was just telling the fine people a better morning and last night in your little hissy fit. Yeah, I but, do that. But it's out of your system now. You're yeah. feeling good. Feeling like a champion. Considering the move I pulled out the window last game. Four prize turn.
<laughs> with a dark ray. Yep. Now, now <laughs> you're set to be punch. a. <laughs> now you're set to be a champion. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, that's us for the moment. We'll fill you in as the day goes on. We're going to try and record a little at the event with so many people there. I'm sure a camera won't look out of place. Later. We're on an adventure! Cutting through fields and car parts and stuff. We're doing pretty well. Um, nerves are starting to kick in. Yeah. Definitely. Alan just threw up. Oh yeah, it was not nice. Um, I laughed. But, but we're uh, seeing a lot of people now that we've met in Wales. People saying hello and stuff, recognizing us, so it's pretty cool. Uh, here is the Manchester Trafford Centre, which is pretty cool. We're going to go straight through it and we should get to Event City, Event City pretty soon. kieran has got his hat on, he means business. Let's do this, keep you updated guys. So we've just made it. I don't know if you can see that sign, but they actually have road signs to it. Like, that's... That's a big deal for us, because in Ireland what you get is like... <laughs> that's a, a crazy road. sign that would be broken within an no, hour. You wouldn't saying, even get a poster PKMN on the door. CHCS or something like that. Anyway, this is where we're going to be for the day. Uh, there was another crazy thing that we saw this morning, which was kind of mind-boggling, which was a drive through Starbucks. Starbucks. So people watching this from the States are like, oh, that's normal, we see that every day. We don't. That's the first time we've ever I seen know, anything I like that. I didn't even know Starbucks did a drive through Yeah, that's pretty much it. Us, uh, there's another sign for the Pokemon Nationals. And sea life. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, we're going yeah, to go reg up now, sure, we'll talk to you in a while. Bye. There's a giant Pikachu somewhere down there, but should I think you know Yeah, we'll go up and pretend to catch that giant Pikachu. I don't know, we saw a guy dressed as Ash who ran he pretty ran quick. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's gonna be the coolest picture of the day. Um, yeah, loads of people though. Yeah. This is insane. It looks really uh, tell, tell them the good news about our CDSs. We've got over a hundred street passes, it's not even funny. We're only here like an hour. Yeah. Well, I think I have carpal tunnel syndrome. I can't draw cards. I'm sick of hitting or uh, or right or an A. Yeah, it hurts. Some pretty cool merch stands as well. But sure, that's pretty much it. Uh, Pre-reg is nearly over. Well, now in about ten minutes. So, looking forward to it. It's going to be fun. We can't record as much as we want to because we actually bumped into some friends and they don't want us recording. So, it is what it is. Yeah, you're understandable. Really looking forward to getting to play. Some actually bumped into some people from Wales, so that was fun. Talk to you in a while. Kieran? Yes. Where are we going? To Krispy Kreme. <laughs> and what's two plus <laughs> two plus two? It's four. It's four. It's four. And what is Krispy Kreme's? Uh, someone who needs a Kleenex. <laughs> I assume it's a donut coffee shop because that's Oh it's my god, all I smell is donuts. Oh my god, that's what we were smelling earlier. Yeah. And it smells so delicious like that. I think it's Tim Horton's coffee. Are we eating coffee now? Uh, it's a bad call, but. Okay, you may as well tell the good people how you did. Um, I walked away after six games out of eight at 2-2-2, two, two two, but overall I'm happy than I was at Aberdeer Regionals. Okay. How about yourself? I went 5-2. Oh, <laughs> if only 5-2. Oh, they're closed. No. I'm gonna go jump in front of the Okay, let's just go to Starbucks. <laughs> I'm gonna jump in front of a bus. Oh, oh. I'm living <laughs> Okay, well, this has gone to hell. This has gone from funny to sad and sad to funny. What's happened right here? If alcohol has died and sucked the life out of the place, <laughs> that's exactly what's happened. Right. <laughs> 
We're gonna go get the Starbucks. I just barely missed top cut. I got five two one. It was an insane end to a very very good day. Talk to you in a while. Bye.